LBC caller James said he is sick to the back of his teeth of the Labour Party telling him what kind of Brexit he voted for, James in Clapham told LBC host Nigel Farage I'm a socialist I voted Labour. I was conned into voting for Labour in the Battersea constituency, and let me tell you this now, the only reason I voted Labour is because they said they would agree to the Brexit terms, which I voted for. And now they are turning the backs on it, I am sick to the back teeth of them telling me what I should be voting for, Getty LBC LBC caller James said he is sick to the back of his teeth of the Labour Party I was conned into voting for the Labour Party LBC caller The LBC caller said he voted to leave everything, including the single market and customs union, James branded the Labour MPs as treacherous demons and said he is sick of them telling him what he voted for, he said I have had enough of this, Nigel. I voted out and don't try and tell me what I voted for, Labour MP Stephen Kinnock told the BBC Daily Politics on Monday that there could be a second Brexit referendum because facts surrounding Brexit are changing, Mr Kinnock said John Maynard Keynes famously said, when the facts change, I change my mind. There are new facts coming to light, for example, if we leave the European Union in March 2019 and we see a massive damaging impact on the economy, which many people predict will be the case. I don't really believe so much in forecasting predictions, Brexit Secretary Sir Keir Starmer urged the government to put access to the customs union and single market back on the table during a Commons debate. Following Sir Keir's comments, a party spokesman said we want a final deal that retains the benefits of the customs union and the single market. Options for achieving the benefits of the customs union should not be swept off the table. Labour is flexible as to whether the benefits of the single market are best retained by negotiating a new relationship with the single market or by a bespoke trade deal.